Hey internet, it's Shireen again. Uh, so today marks the day before my surgery, which is such a weird feeling, but it's finally here and um, I wanted to follow up. So I've been on the pre-surgery diet for about, this will be my sixth day I guess, started last Wednesday as my last video. Um, and it's been good. Um, it's been difficult at times for sure, especially when seeing all the other food that people can eat and, you know, walking through a food store has been difficult, but I did not stray and I stuck to it. Um, I lost about eight pounds in like five days, which is crazy. Um, I think a lot of that was water weight for sure. And then after that came the um, fat, I guess, around my liver, which was the point of this. So it makes the surgery easier. I'm just hoping um, tomorrow, once they go in, they'll be like, okay, awesome, we can do this. She followed her surgery, or diet. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so I just got the call, actually. I am going in super early tomorrow morning. And I can't eat after midnight, which is totally fine for me. So should be good to go. Um, I did a lot of thinking this past week and a lot of reflecting. And um, it's just been kind of a whirlwind this past few days. But uh, having everyone's support is super great. It's been so nice to see it from everyone. And... Um, I feel so uh, blessed that I have such great people in my life who are very supportive, family and friends. So that's made things much easier. Um, am I nervous? Nervous? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm definitely nervous. It's my first surgery ever, but I know it'll be good. And um, I think most of it's really going to be mental. Sounds like it. So um, what I'm told to expect during surgery... Um, once I get there, uh, you know, I'll sign some stuff, meet with the surgeon, uh, meet with nurses, all that fun stuff, anesthesia, um, uh, essentially the surgery is going to last maybe about an hour and a half at the most two hours around there, uh, depending on things, but that's the average time. And, um, it's laparoscopic, so it's, uh, shouldn't be anything too risky um, compared to like an open bariatric surgery and that should really be it after that it's gonna be um, a lot of walking after uh, I'm awake and I'm able to actually get up <laughs> um, they'll probably have me walk a little bit every four hours making sure circulation's good no blood clots things like that um, Hopefully, I'll only be staying overnight. At, you know, at the most, typically, you expect is two overnights. But I'm really optimistic at one overnight. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of weirded out by hospitals. Um, but, you know, I'll definitely stay as I need to, for sure. Um, you know, lots of clear liquids. They're making sure you're not dehydrated is the main thing why they're having you stay for a while. Uh, not that the surgery itself takes a long time. And, um, yeah, I'll be able to go home and, and start the process of, uh, the liquid diet after the clear liquid diet for a few days. Uh, um, let's see. So I also wanted to do kind of a, a before, uh, video of my body just to like see the progression and, uh, maybe people who are around my size and weight would help out. So uh, I'm going to do that right now. And... So I'll show you uh, really a full view of things with clothes on, of course. <laughs> So that's me in all my glory. Um, let's see. I've been big all my life, really. Um, I think the highest I've been was several years ago, um, around the 430 mark. 
So um, it may not, to some people, it may not seem like I carry that, um, but I do regardless. Um, and, uh, you know, I've lost 40 pounds of my own. Um, and then, you know, it's kind of been up and down from there. Uh, I've gained back 15, I've lost some, then gained back a little bit. Right now, I'm just over the 400 mark. So, um, yeah, I've kept uh, a good amount off, but I've always been fluctuating. And um, the the lowest I've been has been, you know, definitely breaking that first number. And that's been like, what? <laughs> uh, so... I am hoping that this time it'll stick, for sure, um, as long as I follow everything and as long as you follow everything, definitely, you know, you'll you'll start to see it come off pretty quickly. There's going to be stalls. Um, there's stalls in anything. I had stalls when I was dieting normally. There's going to be stalls with this weight loss surgery, uh, typically, especially in the beginning, when your body is adjusting uh, to the lower intake. So um, your body's like, hey, why are you eating so many, actually super less calories than last time? Um, I don't want you to go into starvation mode. So I'm just gonna try and fight that. So that's the stall, <laughs> really, uh, in a super nutshell version. Um, <laughs> um, but you know, after your body gets used to that, you'll, start to like kick back into the, the weight loss um so yeah so tomorrow's the big day and um i'm hoping to do a video from the hospital itself depending on how i feel um maybe it, it might not be right after of course but maybe the day after um you know especially if i can't sleep in the middle of the night why not do a video <laughs> so um i'll look forward to doing that hopefully and I'll keep uh, updating. Um, thank you guys for all your support and all your um, kind words. And I'll see you on the flip side. Peace.